a very good morning to all of you shri vipul bhai shah mr paul rolly shri kirit bhai bansali shri sunil nayak ji shri nirav bhai bansali shri mitesh gazera shruti reshma lakhani shri savya sachi re all the dignitaries present here all the exhibitors ladies and gentlemen at the outset i would like to thank gjapc for inviting me to this mega event iijs signature 2024 which is one of the biggest international jewelry show organized in india and i must also thank you for organizing this in the city of mumbai because i think this belongs to mumbai the gems and jewelry industry belongs to mumbai as as you have rightly said vipul bhai has said that mumbai accounts for around 72% of indian exports and today our exports are at around 37 billion dollars and our honorable prime minister aspires to take it to 75 billion dollars by 2030 and i think it will be possible only with the help and initiative of organizations like gjepc who have been instrumental in facilitating not just the domestic business but more than that making india one of the biggest international player and facilitating the exports i am very happy that uh, you have completed a new cfc center in just 17 months and that will allow all the players who are in export to have a very hassle free shipment and hassle free paperwork and all the things which are required for exports will become easy i am uh, also very happy that soon we will have our new gems and jewelry park in mahape for which the government of maharashtra has collaborated with you and uh, i think that is going to be our instrument to achieve the much desired number of 75 billion dollar export i think that will create entire new ecosystem in the space of gems and jewelry and uh, although sometimes our media reports that now some other centers are also coming up in india i am very happy you see coming of new centers is always welcome because the trade has to expand so we need several centers but i am sure that uh, with this gems and jewelry park mumbai will not only keep its name as the ace exporter but will create a new record for india in the field of gems and jewelry and i would like to express our government's commitment towards helping you in setting up this gems and jewelry park in a record time i am also very happy that uh, a section will also be dedicated for lab grown diamonds which is for india a very emerging industry 
and uh, which will create lot of value for our country in this trade i think india has been part of this global trade of gems and jewelry from uh, time immemorial and uh, for people gems and jewelry is not just economic investment but it's also emotional investment and that is why whenever a country prospers whenever economy expands this industry also expands this industry also makes a new footprint it symbolizes prosperity and uh, as rightly said by mr paul that uh, the expanding middle class in india would not only make india a exporter but also a very big consumer india has always been a consumer but i think in times to come we'll see a huge expansion in the domestic market as well i'm very happy that new investments are coming in the state of maharashtra in the city of mumbai and i would like to assure you for any industry to grow ease of doing business and cost of doing business are two things which are very important and on both the aspects the government of maharashtra has been working tirelessly and whenever any industry comes to us with their problems we make sure that we troubleshoot those problems because we realize that if india has to become a 5 trillion economy we need to make maharashtra 1 trillion dollar economy and if we have to make maharashtra 1 trillion dollar economy it is only possible if we make doing business hassle free i am very happy that institution like bharat diamond bourse is also present in mumbai which actually symbolizes a very unique ecosystem and uh, we would like to see more such institutions and i'm sure that not just one gems and jewelry park but whenever gjepc will think about creating any new ecosystem any new institution your natural first choice has to be maharashtra and we'll ensure that we'll partner with you we'll ensure that will make it hassle free i once again would like to thank you for inviting me to this signature event i would like to give my best wishes to all the exhibitors i'm sure that uh, who's who from the industry is present here it will make new connections it will allow everyone to expand their business and i'm absolutely sure that this signature event will be a huge success thank you for having me here thank you jai hind jai maharashtra